welcome to day three of vlogmas and as you can tell i've lost my voice uh but i'm here as a post as i choke myself with my shawl this is my uh by the way uh, find your fade Ooh, there you go sorry about that I gave myself an ethereal glow. Um, good morning. I'm gonna try not to blabber on so that way I can put more stuff for today. Um, iMovie has a limitation on devices where you, when you edit and then you import it from iMovie to YouTube, um, it can't go beyond 15 minutes. And, um, I don't want to try to do more than just that one step. So I figured 15 minutes is good, um, but I won't blabber on. I was looking at the video from yesterday and I was blabbering on about how much uh, it annoyed me about the sound. So um, I have some videos to put in after this about um, my shelving and a little tour of my library. Um, and you should have seen day three of the advent calendar. Um, and you should also see from yesterday, um, uh, uh, me winding up my advent yarn. I'm just going to make some Franken, Franken socks. So kind of like the comfy knitters advent calendar self-striping, I'm going to be doing that. So, you know, cause I thought it was fun and I believe I should have enough um, I'm gonna try not to talk too much today. Uh, I have to do some more shelving because that's the life of a librarian. What else today? Doing my usual lessons. I'm, I didn't really get to talk about what I'm doing for lessons. Um, huh. so kindergarten, which I have my first kindergarten class today. I'm helping them get more comfortable with computers and signing in through their QR codes. So we're doing that today, which usually it's like notebook reading. It's just them getting used to it cause it takes forever. Um, cause you know, motor skills. And then do I have a second or third grade today? I don't think so. Um, no, not today. But second and third grade, I'm finishing up a series of lessons about the Statue of Liberty and talking about sources, primary sources, secondary sources. Um, and then fourth and fifth, I'm talking about culture, which if you're not following me on Instagram, um, if you do check me out, if you want to check out, um, there's a highlight about why I'm teaching about culture. Um, it's about culture day and how angry I got in the politics. Um, my Instagram account, by the way, is Knitterly Book Lady. Um, so, yeah, if you want to check that out, if you don't know why I'm teaching it, because really, culture is not something that librarians teach, but, um, since no other teacher is teaching it, and they, you know, whatever. Anyway, so, so far, it's been a good conversation about culture and how it's not just about race and where you're from or where your family is from so but yeah hopefully i can manage without a without a voice um they are off the hook the kids are so off the hook um they're just they're so ready for a longer break so and because it's it's been raining they haven't been really playing outside so they're just full of energy and talking so hopefully I can get them to quiet down enough to have a conversation so anyway I'm going to stop talking and give my voice a rest and uh, get some morning work done all right bye so this is like a quarter of what I get for shelving The other stuff I kind of put away as I go because I know where they go. But these are series or graphic novels. Oh my God. 
They're not at the best of health, but they're popular. And then these are nonfiction. <sighs> this is my dreaded one because ugh, a lot of bending down and I get a lot of these ones. No, these ones. Sorry. But let me give you a quick tour. So you saw a little bit of the computer lab. This is the library. So this is picture books. That's the entrance. More picture books. This is where I put like themed books. So it's uh, the holidays, winter, Kwanzaa, Christmas. I had some Hanukkah books, but they quickly went out the door. Um, Chinese, Spanish, and then this is biographies. This is everyone's favorite section, graphic novels. It looks like a weird construction, but I have a system. Manga, adventure, artistic, adventure, adventure, amulet, boxcar, all Raina Tubmeyer, like Babysitter's Club, Smile. If you don't know what I'm talking about, well, you don't have children. Elephant and Piggy. See how, oh my goodness. Dr. Seuss. These are the early chapter readers, so they're considered E, but they're like early chapter books. And then here's all my series and then more graphic novels as biographies more and then this is all non-fiction hello tv that's where i do my lessons if i'm doing books if i'm book reading and whatnot and then this is all the chapter books i try to keep it organized oh Three books that I've weeded. I should really just get rid of them. Oh, and I let the kids sit on these when we're doing book clubs or whatnot. It helps them keep still a little bit, but that's my library. Oh, that's my desk. But this is where I live. Good evening. Trying not to get my husband. Ah, so it's been a long day. <sighs> my library's so hot that I always feel like I have the flu if I'm not feeling well. And then I go outside and I realize, no, it's just the library. I'm right next to the boiler room. That's why. So if I'm cold, it's great. <laughs> um, but came home, my husband got us Chinese, my family, usually when we're feeling sick, we, we get what we call Chinese chicken noodle soup, which would be war wonton soup with noodles. Um, my husband tried, Peter tried to get some, that's my cat, um, tried to add, have, ask them to add noodles, but they didn't understand and they didn't want to, so, or didn't understand, so, oh well. I still got soup and um, some other stuff. I wanted to take a video of it and then I forgot. And then we watched Batwoman while I knit. I don't know why I'm doing this, but I am knitting Chris, I'm doing Christmas knitting. Now I normally knit for my husband, um, 
but I realized I forgot to get a present for my, I call her Auntie. Auntie, it's a sign of um, endearment and love for my dad's lady friend. So um, I'm making her a scarf. I'm making her a hitchhiker. So I'm working on that. I figure if I keep doing a couple of teas every, a couple of teas, if you don't know the pattern, check it out. Search on Ravelry. It's Hitchhiker by Martina Bem. They can hear your solitaire. Um, I'm sorry about that. And that's Teddy. So, um, if you don't know what the Hitchhiker pattern is, check it out. It's Hitchhiker by Martina Bem, B-E-H-M. And, uh, so I'm, I figure if I do a couple of teeth every night, I should be able to finish by Christmas. So... Uh, I did that, and then I did um, some cycling. Um, it's a recumbent bike, indoor recumbent bike. So it's not a full stand-up like a Peloton, but it works. So I did 15 minutes of that, did my yoga, did my meditation, and now I'm going to relax. I'm working. I'm starting my Advent socks, which I talked about this morning. Here's the little toe. What I'm gonna do is usually I do uh, socks two at a time, um, but this time I'm gonna do them um, separate at the same time. So I'm gonna start the toe on this, then I'm going to, with the second ball, start it on another one. And I'm using, let me, uh, let me turn it around, making a mess. Um, so this is what I'm working on right now. And I do that while I read. That's what this is. This is a book stand. So I read and do this. And let's see. Let's find. So here's the two uh, cakes, actually, not balls. That's my advent. Where did I put? I know I put it. Ah, here it is. I'm using Blue Moon Fiber Arts, uh, socks that rock, lightweight. It was cheeky it wound this up. Socks that rock, ten lords a leaping. So, I mean, come on, Christmas. I figure that it's all Christmas related, and even if it doesn't really match, I haven't went. It's fine. It'll be fine. It's going to be wacky. And it's going to be fine. All right, let me switch. Yeah, it'll be fine. I don't care. Because it's going to be my socks based on my advent calendar. So, anyway, I'm going to close it off here. I'm going to edit, hopefully make it under 15 minutes. Anna, that's Vlogmas Day 3. Thank you for joining me today.